Hey everybody, Maxwell Ventura, real estate broker associate here in San Diego. This is my week in real estate. Timestamps will be in the description. As usual, we will start off with the cigar of the week and then we will get right into it. This is a Monte Cristo White Series. It's a medium bodied cigar with a creamy golden Ecuadorian Connecticut wrapper. It has a Nicaraguan binder and a blend of Dominican and Nicaraguan long fillers. The, uh, the White Series, it's one of the most popular cigars in the Monte Cristo brand. The flavor profile is going to consist of toasted almonds, subtle cedar, a hint of spice, cream, cocoa, caramel, earthy tones, pepper, and vanilla. Get some. Here we go. Let's spark her up. As usual, I like to toast the edges. This is also a four pronged lighter or flame, so it torches the hell out of it very quickly. <sighs> Got to tilt the cigar the right way when you're doing that because if you, if you have it the wrong way, I've had it where it's actually singed, singed my hair before. So you got to be careful. All right, my week in real estate. So first, uh, last weekend we had the storm, which I obviously was built up way more than it was. I really enjoyed it. I stayed in here Saturday night and Sunday, and we had a nice ambient, rainy, kind of dystopian uh, feel. I just, I worked. It was nice to listen to the rain while working. It was soothing. Um, then I had, this week, I had my coaching call. Again, accountability. We need it in every aspect of our life. Um, I went to a workshop for mastering creative financing, specifically for realtors, be, for us to have tools to be able to offer our clients other options than the, than the standard conventional or FHA. One thing we talked about is that more sellers want to sell now but can't than ever before. Uh, my title company gave us a statistic that 45% of sales right now coming across their desk are in the form of distress. So that is a huge amount. I was very surprised to hear that. Uh, some of the things that we talked about in this creative finance, we talked about bridge loans where you can use your current home's equity as a down payment to purchase your next property and also renovation loans or home improvement loans which allow homeowners to finance necessary renovations when purchasing. So that could be a, a kitchen or any other essential repairs. I'm going to talk a little bit more about this in my tip of the week coming up. We also discussed non-QM, which is non-qualified mortgages, so like bridge loans or DSCR, which are debt service coverage ratio, which are loans that are based on the cash flow of a property rather than so much the borrower's actual income. Um, I also attended the Hives Grand Opening. So this is Real Talk Media's new state-of-the-art multimedia conference and event center. It's designed really specifically for us, for real estate agents, to help us create our own media, build our own brand, and host live events. And I have to say, I did great with my diet all the way up until the very end of the event. I didn't have any champagne, nothing, but I did grab a couple cookies on my way out the door. And for me, it's like as soon as I break the seal in a sense, like the floodgates open. And I, I had, I think I had pizza or, or some kind of sub directly after that on my way home. So. Momentum, keep the diet clean. Uh, later in the week, I had showings for a client right here downtown in a couple different condos. We had La Vida and 350 West Ash. And then this past weekend, I was actually in Vegas for a NFL draft party with a bunch of guys. I knew a couple of guys, but over half of them I didn't. I haven't played fantasy football in probably 10 years. Not since I lived back in Philadelphia where I was, a, I was way more obsessed with sports than I am now. Now I like to play them whenever I have free time. Uh, but I decided to be a yes man when I was asked to join this league. I said, sure, why not? Get in front of uh, some new people, create some good relationships. So. That's what we did this past weekend. We were in Vegas. It was fun. Now I'm back ready to work. If any of you out there have any questions about the market or questions about buying or selling, you know how to reach me. I'll see you on the next video.